Hey everybody! We are here for another Gen 3 game. Yeah, I'm gonna have two Gen 3 things on my channel. Woo! Okay, anyway, I don't know. Ah, I'm moving things. Anyway, so yeah, I'm having two Gen 3 games on my channel. One is Ruby, the other one, Sapphire. This is definitely Sapphire, Ruby. So, welcome to the first episode of the Pokemon Ruby Wedlock. And I'm excited for you guys to kind of see see the see the ordeal, see what's going on. I think that it's definitely a good thing for you guys to kind of get a lay of the land. We're doing a new type of series. I've never done one of these before. Shocking. Something I've never done uh, in my seven years of Poketubing. I did this... Actually, I guess, technically speaking, I did do this, but... It was back in the day when I was stupid and didn't know how to record. Um, or didn't know how to record very well, I should say. And it should not, it should be coming out of my head. Found. Okay, I think it's... I, it should be doing what it's supposed to be doing. I just gotta remember to turn it down for Soul Link. So, we got Professor Birch. And like I said, we're doing a wedlock. And now, what is a wedlock, would you say? Well, a wedlock is like... The Soul Link for poor men. It's the poor man's Soul Link. Um, or basically the antisocial man's Soul Link. Also, Birch has a Swalat. But basically, both your Pokemon are paired. So, like, you get teams of six, right? You get your first Pokemon, and you have to pair your second Pokemon. And you can only battle within the pair. So, like, if you have pair one out, po like A, and B, A, B, C, D, E, F. If you have Pokemon A out, and then Pokemon B is your only Pokemon that you can switch into. So on and so forth. Um, now, there are going to be some rules. So, in lots of people's wedlocks, and in most wedlocks, I should say, you usually do male and female pairs. I'm not about that life. Um, literally and figuratively. Um, obviously, uh, being part of the um community and the the um the lgbtq whatever letters are left community um i wanted to help with that too because i think that it'd be cool to kind of do a, a nuzlocke like that so what we did is i looked up some stats online I looked up a few things Got some statistics and used basically real life, pseudo real life data to whatever it's called to make it so that we could use natures instead to determine the Pokemon's sexuality. I know this is like in depth. Blah, 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 blah. So I figure, and what will happen, right, is when I go through now, the links to this will be, or the uh, not the links to this, but the, um, natures will be listed in the description on, like, what their sexuality is. Also, I'm gonna give this right now. Big shout out to King Culpa. King Culpa made the art for the series, because I figured this is kind of a series that needed a lot, or some pretty good art, um, and I shouldn't even say pretty good. That's, an, uh, like, the understart understatement of the century. Some really good art, um, is needed, because I just, I can't make good art. Like, and I'll, like, I'll slide by, like, most of the things, because I don't usually like, you know, like, I don't know, I can't, I, I don't know, I, I, uh, uh, I just can't, <laughs> commentary, hello, um, but anyway, so I'm just one of those people that am terrible at art, so, Copa, nice job to you, thank you, his link will also be in the description, um, because whatever I hire an artist or like ask an artist to do something i want to uh be sure to credit them verbally so you can hear their channel but then also in the in the comments or in the not the comments the description so that you can kind of see it both ways like if you just are one of the few people that actually peep the description uh props to you by the way um then you know you'll see it in, in the description if you actually if you watch the video you'll hear it in the video so anyway and i try and do it towards being what we're two minutes in or four minutes in close enough 
Um, so like I didn't, I did it pretty soon, but yeah, thank you Culpa for the art. It helps out, makes the series look cooler. I'm hoping I'm using the right one, cause like he sent me a background, and that's what I'm using. But then when I opened the background, it was a completely different picture. So I was like, I was like, I don't know. So I just used the ones with the yellow hearts and the filled in stuff. I'm probably wrong, but. It actually worked out better for me to have it filled in for the series that I'm doing. Um, whereas he knows most of the time I just use, um, just, they're all blacked out. Um, but yeah, I can hear something. Oh no. But hey, we're not going to do a choose my starter because I want to just hop right into this. I'm sorry, y'all. Um, this is just straight episode one. So, um, cause I, like I said, I want to hop in, nosedive into this while I can, cause I'm still in school. Um, and you're gonna actually get some uploads of the series. There is no consistent upload schedule on the series while I'm in school. I'm hoping to get three episodes a week in this series. Maybe more. Uh, maybe less. Um, especially as filler. Oh, I should probably, um, I don't know. We know Hypno is one of our Pokemon. Hypno is actually not a bad mod. Um, I should probably explain what's randomized too, but I, th what I'm thinking, don't quote me on this. I'm thinking Monday... When I want, I was gonna say Monday, Wednesday, Friday, but that I'm thinking like it's a weird thing. But Sunday, Tuesday, Sunday, Tuesday, and Thursday. No, I can't do Tuesday because Papa. You can tell I did not plan this out. Um, Sunday, Thursday, Sunday, Monday, and Thursday. There. <laughs> So, we got Hypno, we got Huntail, and we got Mistrovus. Honestly, I like specially defensive Pokemon. Hypno's kind of a weird start, but we'll go with that. Um, we And, oh, so, what's randomized? Moves are randomized, like the moves that are learned. Um, they're randomized, preferring same type. Um, let's see, what else do we got? Um, abilities are not randomized. Um, trainers both want to randomize. We force fully evolve at like level 30 something, because that's about when what's like the fifth gym, uh, Norman, becomes um, a thing. It's when Norman becomes. Fully evolved! If he gets to the level. I can't think. Okay. Anyway, it's a male Hypno. I actually going to name it Gen 2. Because that's kind of, I like. I think Gen 2 would really appreciate being a Hypno. Um, I don't know. I just see uh, Gen 2 being Hypno. He's like, hashtag hypnotizes people. Um, okay, so Gen 2 the Hypno. Uh, unfortunately, we can't name a rival in this series. So, I was going to name it Karai. But... I can't name it Karai if I have no option to name it Gen 2. So Gen 2 the starter. Yes, let's go meet May. So let's go ahead and look at the nature. And I have to use the key too because I'm 100%. You are a hardy nature, therefore you are straight. Okay, it is a straight male Pokemon. Okay. So, let's get Hypno on the layout, on said layout. And you'll see the, the icon for, I guess, straight. Um, Hypno's Gen 1. There we go. Do we get it? Oh, I thought we did. And, like, I actually have groups and stuff. So, like, I actually should be able to, you should be able to see things. So, there's Hypno, our man Hypno, and I don't know which one's which. I should probably have labeled them, because that might have been a good idea. Wait, what is happening? Oh, I'm dumb. There. There we go. So that sign is our straight sign. Um, 
And you had a rare candy. Well, wait a, wait a start, Gen 2. Getting rare candies early. So, what does that mean? That means our Route 102 encounter, or 101, or whatever encounter we get first, has to be female. Because our encounter has to be what is what can be paired with the Mon. Not, but... I, I can already hear you guys saying it, but what if it ends up being a lesbian? Well, then, if, then it becomes a lone wolf, which, so when it, and when it becomes a lone wolf, it legitimately means that, well, it's a lone wolf, so it can't be, um, can't be paired, which means, and what happens in that scenario is it gets on the team until we get to a point where, well, like, nothing can be added to the team. And then, or like, there is no more pairings left. So, that's how that will work. Um, so, you know. Um, we did level boost this, so it's 15% boosted. So that you guys do know that. It is 15% level boosted, so. We're gonna have fun with the level boost. Ha! <laughs> that's kind of funny that that cry was there. And you are gonna have the hot tail. Okay. And a psycho boost. Get this thing dead. Woo! Okay, level 7. Gen 2, out here, destroying lives. We can go back to the lab. Gotta hurry home. I know, I understand the feeling. But, no. So, I think the series is gonna be a fun series. I think it's a different kind of series, which I think makes it just that much more fun. Because, I like, it, this kind of wedlock, I've only seen once. So, that always helps. Okay, we got the Pokedex. They're gonna give me Pokeballs. There we go. So Route 101 is the first encounter. Oh wait, mom gives me running shoes. Yay! Just I'm just what I do is I'm just skipping through text. So Route 101, uh, female has to be the encounter. The encounter has to be female. Giraffe rig. It is a female. So therefore, this is the Pokemon. That's very. That's a very interesting Pokemon, actually, to say the least. Like, I don't mind that Pokemon. I've never used one. I've never thought about... Oh, this has called mine already! Let's go! Okay, I'm gonna miss ball then. This should be fine. Like, this should be no problem. Wait, Whirlwind? Oh, no. Is this Razor Wind? Is this gonna kick me out? Probably. Oh, no, it didn't. Okay, missed ball. Okay, so I have no other options but to try. Yeah! Got the drop a rig! Yes, yes, yes. So, is this gonna be our psychic pair? Are we gonna have a pair of psychic type Pokemon? Because, unlike a Soul Link, I'm gonna name this Joy. Because, unlike a Soul Link, you can have Pokemon of the same type. You could be monotype, you never know. Okay, is Joy and Gen 2 linked up together? We'll find out right now. You are a brave nature with inner focus. Brave is a straight nature. So therefore, both of them are paired. Okay, Giraffe Rig is Gen 2, to my knowledge. I could be completely wrong. Uh, yeah, Giraffe Rig. I always think Giraffe Rig is like Gen 4 because that's I just relate it to Gen 4. Forgetting that, oh wait. It may actually not be the generation that I'm thinking it is. And then, yeah, so that is Mon number two on the squad. Uh, group, get it into group number two. And there we go. That is pair number two. Or well, that is the first initial pair, which means that if Gen 2 is leading, the only switch in is Joy. So. Yeah, that's a little bit of a... I don't... I don't really... I don't... That pairing has so many weaknesses that that can prove to be a problem. Because you want the pairs to be able to balance each other out. Not necessarily... You don't necessarily need the Pokemon to balance out. It's one of those weird things in a, in a wedlock. You, you don't really... If the, if, the pair, if the Pokemon don't balance out, that's okay because you're going to be using the pairs anyway. Like, you can't swap outside of a pair... And so, yeah, it's just one of those, like, weird things. Okay, so this means that this next Pokemon is a free range. Whatever Pokemon we get, we get. Time to explain how genuine Pokemon work! Um, because I didn't think we'd encounter one this early in the game. So 
So genderless Pokemon are automatically pansexual. Um, now, genderless Pokemon can only be repaired or paired with a pansexual Pokemon or a fellow genderless Pokemon. So basically, this Rayquaza is going to be a lone wolf, but if we catch it. But I mean, it's Rayquaza. Like, it can be a lone wolf. <laughs> I'm okay with that. Like, I can't say that it can't be. Oh no, we burned it. Who likes burning Rayquazas? I don't. Dang it. Stupid burn. I mean, I had nothing to help it, but... Well, so that's how Gen of the Spoken One worked. We unfortunately lost the Rayquaza, which is unfortunate. Very, very unfortunate, but we live with it. Okay, so... Our run of two encounter... Abilities aren't randomized! Ah, that sucks. Because <laughs> this is going to guaranteed to have Truant, basically, is what that means. So with it guaranteed having Truant, I'm like, I don't really know if I want it or not. Swagger. What a weird move to have. Okay, Slacking has been caught. The lazy Pokemon. We're going to name this... I'm gonna name it Papa. Papa Agron. Papa the Slacking. Coming out early. Okay, we know that sadly this thing's gonna have Truant. Unless some random reason it doesn't. Yeah, okay. So it's got Truant, sadly. Although it's got Sing, Heal Bell, Thrash, and Swagger. Which is a weird moveset. It is Quiet Natured. I think is a straight nature. It is. It is a straight nature. Hey, I'm remembering half of this stuff. Surprise. Uh, slacking is a Gen 3 Mon, so we have a Slacking. Slacking is in the PU tier, but I mean, it's a good Mon. It's just it can't attack every turn, which makes it the P in the PU tier. Um, which, okay, so that also means that our next Pokemon has to be a female. Or that we catch has to be a female. Which, I mean, I don't mind. Honestly, like, I don't really mind what Pokemon we get. I just, I'm happy to be doing this. Um, okay, so it's got Truant. And so that means that if I have Papa out, I literally can't swap. So Papa is definitely not going to be out for a while. So I want to make sure that Papa can actually, like, be utilized the correct way. And if we run into a fighting type, like, we don't die. So... I'm going to keep Gen 2 and whatever in the front. Gen 2 and Joy. Although, they are making it very hard on me to do that. I will say that. Like, they are making it very hard on me to do that. I'm going to Heat Wave just kind of get rid... Get Gen 2 leveled up Onyx. Oh, I don't like that. I'm just going to Psycho Boost, though. That should kill it. Perfect. We like this. We like how this is going. I mean, obviously. We had a slacking as our encounter. Of course, we like how this is going. Uh, Mist Ball, that kills that. And uh, Rustboro City's gym leader is level, like, 16. Because we level boost at 15%. Ooh, Reflect. Uh, I don't see me using Reflect. And a Moltres, we can just like a boost that. We did not just miss twice. Okay, and we could get these, might as well. Like, there's no harm in picking the berries. Because, I mean, we're not going to have them at all anyway afterwards. Kadabra. And a Bulbasaur. Well, that was a fight. We're just blowing through it. And I don't mind using speed up. I feel like this is going to be a very quick series. We found Carbos. Hey, we take that. That's money. We can't We can't say no to money. We actually can't. Like, that's not a thing that we can do. Um, okay, so. Petalburg. We'll get an encounter later. One thing I will do right now is sell that Carbos. 
because that's $4,900. And then we'll buy in multiples of 10. And then we'll buy four potions. Because then we're back down to 160 something. But with that being said, we are going to. We're still like 20 minutes in. Holy crap. Talk to your dad in Petalburg. Okay, and then we talk to Wally. Wally catches the Pokemon that we didn't ran we didn't randomize this because, well, we really couldn't do that. Because they didn't want to mess up the catching tutorial, like almost what almost happened. So Route 104, what are we encountering here? So in Route 104, an elected is a male, we cannot use that. Because because Papa is a straight male, we have to counter a female ride on. I like that. That's a powerful pair, actually. Like, I ain't gonna lie, that's a pretty powerful pair. Uh, not very effective. Shouldn't do that much damage. Mud sport. And then we're gonna just Pokeball this thing until it gets caught because we're in the we're in the game of doing that. Oh, maybe not. Come on. There we go. Rhydon has been caught. What is Rhydon? Rhydon's name is going to be. Baka. I was... I'm gonna run out of names real quick. So make sure to leave yourself comments or comment in the comment section below so that I can actually... It is Da... Whoa! It's docile! Which means it is a pansexual ride on. This is gonna be very good. It's gonna help a lot, but... Hey! We, we, now we're representing. Look at that. Out here representing right on I really want to change its name to something now I actually might change it but I actually probably will not there we go look at that and we get one more encounter in today's episode, and we'll end it. But before we do that, we're going to go ahead, heal up at the Pokemon Center. And then I'm going to have to train up anyway. And realistically, I'll probably just end the episode. Because I've got school that I have. So I don't want to, like, you know, not sleep for that. That's kind of important. Petalburg Woods. So we, literally it's anything goes, execute. Okay, a female execute. Well, we caught the execute first try. Uh, we're gonna name this, Shh. Shelly. Okay, that's definitely the hidden item that I remember. And that's gonna be the only one I do remember, probably. I feel like there was hidden items here that I'm just completely blanking on. Oh my gosh, another slacking. I don't slacking's a little bit of a scary mon, but the fact that we have one is really nice. This ball. I forgot where they were. You guys are gonna scream at me. You're gonna be like, you should know where they are, John. Like. But yeah, so I can't remember where they are, to be fair. But, like I said, this is a great place to end the episode and kind of just train up, figure out what we're gonna do. But if you guys like the series, let me know. Because I think this is gonna be just a really fun series in general. Um, different kind of series, which is going to make it that much better. 
Um, I don't know. I think our pairings are pretty good. We got an execute that I got to add to the squad. Oh, speaking of execute, what is your lax is our first non wow okay so it is a female that is into females it is a lesbian okay look at that and so that will make this execute a little bit harder to pair just a little bit but hopefully not very much because I think I believe I believe group five it's not that one it's that one okay well in the next episode everybody will be a lot like 10 ish um maybe even more because we yeah level 10 is fine um because we don't have a gym we don't net until episode three so level 10 is whatever it's going to be up at um thank you guys so much for watching like comment subscribe and we'll see you in the next episode on another day Bye bye